This is something non-hockey related. I don't know if you heard, but a speed skater today for Canada who qualified, he gave up his spot to Denny Morrison, another Canadian speed skater. Morrison had an injury, couldn't qualify, and said, Morrison's got a better chance at a medal for Canada than I do, so I'm gonna give up my spot. Works a lifetime to get here, gives it up. Morrison ends up winning a silver. When you hear that as somebody who's staying in the village who marched in the opening ceremonies, what does that mean to you? Well, you just told me that and I just got shivers. You know, it's a team, Team Canada here, it's, we're a big team. It's not just our hockey team. It's not just the speed skater. We're all a big team. And it shows that um, athletes have support. We have our back. And as a nation, we want to uh, make our country proud. And I think what he did tonight is amazing. And uh, kudos to him. I mean, I have so much respect for that, that kid that could give up his spot. And just knowing that his team member could do better than him, I think that's that's huge. And I mean, I look at the girls around me and you know what, I have so much belief in them and that means that other teams are kind of like our team and you know, they're individual sports, but in the end they're they're vying for their players to do the best that they can. It's wild, isn't it? Yeah, it's, it's amazing. I'm glad he got a silver medal out of it. That's that's even better. <laughs> he had a pretty good chance to medal, so that's, uh, that's a great news and um, obviously very uh, admirable of his teammate to give up his spot. <laughs> it's awesome. I think uh, you know there's a lot of pride and uh, just to be able not only to be part of the hockey team but the entire Canadian Olympic team. You really feel it uh, walking in the opening ceremonies but uh, as the Olympics go on and, and you see um, you know a lot of our athletes doing well it just kind of encourages us and motivates us uh, going forward.